probably lots of scary things down here. Like those. Yep, yep, yep. Come on. Up, up, up. Uh oh. Up. Okay, okay, okay. Uh oh. Can I not fight underwater? Oh, I can't. Okay, can I get on a lily pad? Oh, really? Okay, I can get on a lily pad. Alright, so I can't swing this underwater. Um, maybe our spear. Hey everybody, welcome back to Grounded. Alright, in this episode, we are going to... A couple things I want to do. We're going to try to continue the quest line where it says craft diving gear up there in the top left. And so we're going to head to the pond today. We have not been to the pond yet, so I'm excited about that to take you guys to the pond. And the first thing I want to talk about, though, is our mutations. I haven't talked about mutations at all because, honestly, I didn't know anything about them. So I did a little research on my own and read about them. And what they do, they each have different, they're like a buff or a perk, okay? They each have different abilities. And some of these you can earn just by doing things within the game. Some of them you can buy from Burgle. So I currently have four mutations. And if we click on them, they'll tell us what, what they do for us. This one is a Ant Annihilator. And it says, The Ant has become a familiar threat, and you begin to know your enemy inside and out. Death and devastation greet all ants that face you. So we got that one turned on. And to deactivate them, you just highlight it. Click space and it's deactivated. Over here it shows us the mutations that are active. So I do want this active, so I'm going to reactivate it. And again, you can have three active at the same time. So we've got the ant one. This one says Natural Explorer. Tendrils of your memory map every bump, crack, and path between each new landmark found until the lawn becomes as familiar as the back of your hand. Powered by intuition, your tiny feet skitter through the muck and weeds ever quicker. So this one adds to our quickness, okay? And again, it's listed over here. Uh, one other thing I want to add, some of these have different phases. This one has three phases. This one has three... Yeah, this one has three phases as well. And you have to do a certain amount of... Like this one is kill so many ants, and we'll, go, we'll get to phase two of this one. Okay, and then the third one I've got activated is Cardio Fan. It says, exhausting your tiny body over and over again, your cells adopt a more efficient resp respiration process. So that should help with our our hyper stamina, that's what it says over here. So that should help with our stamina when we're doing different activities. Okay, so that is mutations in a nutshell. Again, it shows us over here what we have active. And these effects are effects that I have on my gear different gear that I'm wearing the ant stuff the acorn stuff that's that brings our effects over here that's what's listed over here so I hope all that makes sense again I just learned about this myself I'm not sure which ones oh the other one I, I have also is javeliner javeliner range is your greatest ally as you reach out and stab your foes from afar spears are increasingly deadly in your hands and when thrown so this one we would want to activate when we know we're going to be, you know, fighting ants. So I would probably activate this one and this one we're fighting ants. Um, hopefully we're not going to run into a whole lot of ants today. That's not my goal for this episode. So anyway, that's what, that's what we'll leave active. So you can see I'm hurting on water. So let's see what time it is. It is 1. We're going to go drink some water and then we're going to sleep till it's morning. Do I have any? I can't remember if I put any water in here or not. I did. Yeah, so our canteen is empty. So we need to refill our canteen. We've got our dew collector up there. I'm hoping that that gets us some dew in the morning. Uh, oh, it's got some right now. Cool. All right, let's get our canteen out. Uh, let's see. Let's put him, put him down here for now. And let's collect this. Beautiful. Now, when we go back to our inventory, 
it shows one. This holds two drops. We have one in there now. Let's throw that back up there. We'll get our mushrooms back down here. And we'll check in the morning after we sleep. And maybe we'll have another another drop out here on our dew collector. We built that last episode, if you weren't with us. Alright, so let's go down here and... We will... I'll tell you what. We're going to be okay now, I think. till morning. So let's go ahead and sleep... There we go. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and sleep, and then we will head to the Koi Pond in the morning. And I'm ex again, I'm excited about that, because there's some items that we need from the Koi Pond to continue our quest and to craft our diving gear. Alright, so let's go over here and sleep. Tiny Hit space. Alright, so that killed us in the water. I do not want to use my yep we got another do beautiful this was very time consuming to make this do collector well not too bad but we just had to gather some things so let's do that now we have we've got two two scoops in our canteen we'll just carry that around with us yeah there's our canteen right there now it shows two so we got two scoops and we're going to we're going to go over here to the juice box and see if we can get us a drop over here to start our day off. We've got some food. We've got nat roast. Yeah. And we got plenty of mushrooms. So we're okay there. All right. Let's see if we can get a drop here. Get us a good start today. Yep. We got one. Cool. All right, let's go ahead and eat some mushrooms. Better than starving, I think. That'll get our food all the way up. All right, we're maxed out on our food. We've got we've got water for backup. Uh, let's see, maybe I can find another. Should be able to find another dew around here close top us off since it's morning time and where we're gonna go today we're going to hit the koi pond which is right over here there's the oak lab we've kind of we've looked at the the uh, koi pond a little bit now, I don't know what this is oh missing burgle chip oh nice I didn't know that even showed up on the map okay cool maybe we can Maybe we can find those. Because uh, that's one of our quests, find the fishbowl burgle chip. But I think we probably, I think those are probably down pretty deep, I'm guessing. So, let's see, we need to go, we need to go this way. Yep. But I do want to find, hopefully, another dew droplet along the way. Wow, this game's just beautiful. Graphics are still amazing to me. The sounds, the graphics. Oh, I meant to look and see if we had any any more spider silk. I need one of the weapons that I want to make. There's some spider. So there's some spider webbing over there, which of course means spiders. So, let's take a gamble. Let's see if we can run in here and get this and get out. We got, we got one web fiber. There's more over there. Uh oh! Hey, 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 hey! Go, go, go! I'm stuck. Ah, oh, 
I gotta get out of this. He's got me stuck. Alright. We're gonna take you on, buddy. I don't know if I'm hurting him at all. Alright, let's run. Let's run. Alright, I gotta... I gotta first aid. Uh-oh. Another spider. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yep, I knew that was gonna be a problem. I got two of them on me. Ripped apart by an or orb weaver. Okay. Uh, why did it put me back here? Oh, did I not set that as my respawn point? I guess I didn't. Alright. Grab that sap on here. Alright, so wasn't quite prepared for two orb weavers there at the same time. We've got to let's see how damaged our weapon is. A little bit. We've got a better weapon now. I think we could take some of those orb weavers on. Just I wasn't quite prepared for them. We're going to run right by our base. And I want to make sure and reset that our spawn point. I thought I did that, but obviously I didn't. Set respawn point. Yep. Okay. I never did. Alright, so our bag's back this way. Obviously we gotta get all our stuff back. And then we'll worry about the other things that we plan on doing today. Alright, beautiful. Now, let's regroup. Uh, we do have some web fiber, which is good. i tell you what, we're so close to our base. Let's put this web fiber back and get it working in our spinning wheel. Hello, Mrs. Ladybug. I don't think they will hurt you unless you attack them. Yeah, let's put this stuff... I think we can put all four of them in here. Oh, there we go. You just hit space bar, spin. Yes, yeah, so we got all four of them going there. I meant to look and see if I had any more in here. I do not. Yeah. Do I have any in here? No. But I'm going to leave this stuff that I don't need to carry around. Alright, cool. Alright, let's see if we have any more... Possibly any more do up here. No, I do not. Moving on. Stinking orb weaver over there. I just want to make it to the pond, okay? Show you guys. That's all I'm trying to do. Okay, there's a... Well, there's an orb weaver, but there's also a, uh, a station over there. Alright, let's see if we can go top side here. Probably a little safer.
and just avoid the spiders. Lots of sap, which I don't really need, but I'm going to grab it. Lots of acorns. There's all kinds of resources here that we need. There's also another juice box over here. Yeah, it's over here. Or can, sorry. Juice can. That's got some liquid. Soda drop. And then there's a juice can over here as well. There's a juice just hanging around there. Looks like it just popped out. Nice. Alright, we have made it to the pond. Now, as far as... Okay, there's little things there. I think we, I don't think we can go that deep, though. So as far as getting in and out of the pond... I'm sure there's probably certain areas that we can... Only certain areas we can get in and out. But what we need to check out is these lily pads. Let's just dive in. Let's do it. Okay, so we've got a... We've got an O2 meter. Alright. Okay, so I did a little research. And this is one of the things we need to get right here. Lily pad wax. We also need... There's lots of, probably lots of scary things down here, like those. Yep, yep, yep. Come on. Up, up, up. Uh oh. Up. Okay, okay, okay. Uh oh. Can I not fight underwater? Oh, I can't. Okay. Can I get on a lily pad? Oh, really? Okay, I can get on a little pad. Alright, so I can't swing this underwater. Um, maybe our spear. Alright, let's look at this. Lily pad wax. We need to analyze it. A nodule of wax collected from a flowering lily pad can be used as a strong waterproof bonding material. Okay. Oh, I forgot to equip our helmet. Oh, it's got to be repaired. Darn it. Okay. Ant part and might fuzz. We have that back at the base. Alright, that's the only thing I have that needs to be repaired, though. Okay, so we can't fight underwater. That's interesting. How much time we got? About 3 o'clock. Alright, I want to get some more of this wax. Oh, hi. Are you dangerous? You don't look dangerous. You look nice. Alright, let's find some more of this wax. It's like he's trying to talk to me. Okay, so I can stab with the spear, it looks like. Okay, that's good. Um... Can I do anything? Uh-oh. Definitely gotta watch my O2. So what we're trying to get here is uh, our diving gear, of course. What's this? Is that anything? No? Okay. And that's just sap. I don't need sap. What's this? Oh. Can't do anything with that. Okay. Alright, we need more we need more wax. Alright, avoid the spiders. Get wax. And I think Hey, what's this over here? Is it a bubble? Does that give us O2? Oh, 
Oh, it does. Check that out. Okay, cool. That's helpful. Alright. There's another one. That's very helpful. Okay. Now we need more wax. But I think we can kind of get that. Are we anywhere close? Nope. I was thinking... I was thinking we were maybe close to the thing. The chip. But I think we have to build our equipment to dive down really deep. Is that wax there? It is. Uh-oh. Now we got to get up, up, up. A little scary. Oh, here's a bunch of wax. Okay. Well, two. It's hard work, man, this underwater thing. Can I cut any of these? No. How many wax do we have? Five. I don't know how many I need. Okay, I like the bubble thing. It's helpful. Why is it not giving it to me? There we go. You gotta be right on it, I guess. Um, okay, I don't know if those are dangerous. Okay, here's some more wax. I don't know how many of them need. I'm gonna get, grab these and then we'll go get analyzed. Go analyze it. Yep, yep, yep. Well, you gotta make sure you're not underneath the pad. A lily pad. What's this? Anything? Algae. Decoy bait and green machine. Okay. There's a bunch of al algae here. I don't know if this will help us with our diving gear or not, but we're going to grab it. Up, up, up. Okay. And it's getting dark. Yeah, we better head back. We'll go back and analyze this stuff. Um, I gotta figure out how to get out of here. Where are we at? We need to go back this way. Yes. Wouldn't it be lovely if I could just? Uh, no. I thought if I could just run across the leaves to get out, that's going to be my next issue, is how to get out of here. Come on. Can I get anything off of this nice, pretty leaf? It's very pretty. But it does me no good. Okay, I see a twig there. That looks like our exit. Whoops. What's that? Anything? No. Looks like it should be something. Okay, this is our exit twig. Beautiful. Alright. There's an analyze, analyzing station there. But I'm going to try to make it home. Let's go back to our better weapon. I think we're definitely running faster with those, uh, with the mutations going. Feels like we're running faster. By the power of Helion, champion of the sun! <laughs> I love that. Uh, 
Alright, we made it. Now... Let's see... What do I need to stow away here? We'll stow this away what I can, and then... Oh, I've got this stuff in the big basket. Yeah. Uh, let's see, we're gonna... We need to analyze... Do I need to analyze that? Squishy strip of an animal aquatic plant restores a small amount of hunger. Oh, I can eat it. Oh, okay. Cool. Uh, what do I need to repair this? Two ant parts and might fuzz. Yes, please. Let's repair that. And... Okay, so I don't think, I have to, I don't think I need to analyze this. Okay, we want to equip that. Feeling a little safer now. Yeah, we're feeling safer. Alright, our anal we have an analyzing station close. What was that? The bird? Our lab? Uh... Oh shoot! Dang it! Oh no! No 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 no! No! Mm. Yep. A little less squishy now. Okay, knew that was a problem. Darn it! All right, we gotta get our stuff now. We've worked hard for that stuff. I don't know if, like those spiders. Do they leave the area? I don't know how the game does that. I hope they do. That would be fair. Okay. Man, all I was trying to do is get to the lab. Okay, so after getting wrecked by the orb weaver at night, I'm gonna just sleep and then we'll go analyze. We'll go analyze that in the morning. The Bedtime. wax. Yeah, I just don't want to take a chance. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's see if we got some dew in our dew collector. Oh, nice. We got three. Don't even need to boil it. That is a beautiful thing. Cool. I want to make another one of those at some point. Then we won't, we won't ever have to worry about water. That would be awesome. Um, actually, let's see. Let's, let's put some... Yeah, we, let's get our canteen. Down here. And we'll put some in our water collector. Let's see. Tap to deposit. One. Two. Okay. And now let's go get the other dew that's up here. Scoop. And then we'll get some more throughout the day. Uh oh, maybe stuck. There we go. There we go. Now our canteen is empty, but hopefully we'll find some more along the way. And let's see, I'm gonna go ahead and eat this. Just pretend it's beef jerky. Yeah, the nat roast. Let's see, our mushrooms are probably done. And they are. Your harvest is ready. Collect the guard. Oh, I'm sorry, I have to collect them by hand. There we go. Now I'm going to plant some more. There we go. Yeah, we'll keep that going. Oh, let's keep a stack on us. Yeah. Okay, now I got some more damaged materials. Repair. One acorn shell, crude rope. Yes, please. And let's equip that. That should keep you safe. There we go. We gotta keep our armor. Safer. 
Gotta keep her armor in tip top shape. Alright, cool. Uh, let's see. What? How do I need to make a, more bandages? I had to use a couple of those. Oh, yeah. I mean, that give us. Well, let's make one more. Nice, even 10. Okay. I'll need to make some more. Or get some more plant fiber, but that's all over the place. Gives us 10 bandages. Let's save. Alright, cool. Alright, let's go down and analyze this real quick. I did not want to take a chance on messing with that orb weaver again at night. We were that close to the, to the lab, but that's not a fair fight, fighting those guys at night. Alright, let's see what this does for us here. Science. New recipes deciphered. Slime lantern. Okay. Maybe they changed it. I thought there was a pebblet knife we could make with that. There's a larva blade that poisons. I thought there was a pebblet. Maybe I'm missing something. I thought there was a pebblet knife. Spider fang dagger. We don't have enough spider venom. So this is a level one. I don't have grub hide. I do have an acid gland, but I don't have enough grub hide. Alright, let's go back and look at the the workbench. I see ya. Oh, I stunned him. Funny. Yeah, and I got my mutation going, so that helps with uh, killing ants, ant damage. Yeah, I'm probably going to do a little ant hunting because I want to get this up to phase two. I just don't want it takes to go to phase two. All right, let's look at our workbench here real quick. When I was researching, I thought I came across a pebblet knife. Pebble blade, something like that. Oh, here it is, pebble dagger. Oh, sweet, we can make it. A handy tool for harvesting aquatic flora or for defending oneself against underwater fauna. Okay, so this we can use to kill or to kill those spiders. It's very fast. Look at that. Two pebble, two rope, and two lily pad wax. Slime lantern. A lantern made from hydrophobic materials and slime mold, useful for exploring the murky depths. Oh, okay, we can use this underwater. But we okay, we need this illgrass strand. Okay, all right, let's make the dagger. And decoy bait, a bundle of bait made from tadpole meat, used as a distraction for larger predators. Okay, we can use algae for that. Raw tadpole meat. So we have to kill some... We have to kill tadpoles, I guess. That would make sense. And water flea meat. Okay, we haven't seen either one of these. Very interesting. Alright, so we need this eelgrass strand. That's underwater. We gotta find that, cut that down to make this lantern. Okay. But we got the dagger made. So this is under the underwater category. That's why I couldn't find it. This is only this is items only used underwater. Okay. All right. So a little damage, but it's very fast. Fast slice them, dice them. Okay, I like that. Let's take a look at it. You discovered public public pebblet dagger. Sorry. All right. Let's equip that thing. See what it looks like. I like it. Yeah, it looks cool. You hit U, by the way, to go third person. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be fun. That'll be fun underwater. 
Very cool. Let's grab our... This should all be done. W to take all. Yes, please. And let's deposit that here. Our lovely spider silk. We're going to need that for something. I forgot what. Um, okay, is there anything else we can use that lily pad wax for? I don't think so. Oh, the lantern. Okay, we'll get more of that when we go back down underwater as well. Alright, so let's deposit this. And the algae. Squishy strip of an edible aquatic plant restores a small amount of hunger. So it is edible. Interesting. Okay, well, let's just carry that. And let's. I want to see if we got any more dew up here in our dew collector. Not quite yet. Okay. Alright, so we've just about got the food and water under control finally. Took a minute. Um, Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and end this one here, guys. Hey, this was fun for me. Uh, I died a couple times. I don't like dying in any game. Uh, but it's just expected in this game learning for me It's expected in this game because we're learning the, the fighting mechanics how they work, but uh, this was a good episode I I think we got we got to cover the mutations see how they work and we got the we got the oh. Knife oh. built the underwater knife we got to explore the koi pond so next episode we will head back to that koi pond and I want to get, let's see, what is it that we need to get? What we're trying to make is this diving gear. Okay, so maybe we have to get this eelgrass strand. And then, you know, these question marks, It's there's something else of, of they, you can make with this. So maybe we need that to make the... I can't remember what it's called. It's something that helps you help us breathe underwater. So that's my goal next and then that'll be part of that part of be part of our diving gear i'm probably sure because we need to reach the pond depths to to find these chips these chips right here that's a missing burgle chip and this one's missing burgle chip all right so we'll work on that next episode i uh, hope you enjoyed this episode i had a good time with it and if you enjoyed it make sure to hit that like button and if you're new to the channel make sure to hit that subscribe button i do appreciate each and every one of you that subscribes and come back and join me for more episodes of Grounded. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.